Hey Zesties, I'm Michelle Boyle and welcome or welcome back to my channel Zesty Girl. In today's video I am doing a Costco shop with me, a Costco haul, Aldi, not shop with me, Aldi haul, Coles haul, so that's all my grocery shopping and I'm also discussing with you the meal plan. But not meal prep, meal prep, this video is long enough without meal prep but I will explain in this video what I plan to do, I've got a list here of what I'm going to make and then you can wait for tomorrow's video where I will be cooking, <laughs> it's going to be mega, a mega meal prep. Okay but if you want to see today's video which is basically gathering the groceries and my plan for everything then let's do this. Okay, so here we are entering Costco and I have a definite plan of what I need to get today. I really, I'm really focused on getting chickens because a lot of my meal prep this week is going to be based around Costco chickens. I haven't been to Costco, I don't think for, because we're moving, I don't think I've been to Costco for maybe a month, maybe a month. So the children are saying, oh yeah, we'll have the Costco chickens again because they were getting a bit sick of them. So anyway, let me just take you in store now with me and, and let's get shopping. Just been out this morning and got my mammogram done. Just dodging people. Um, and that was a good job done. I felt sort of quite, I'm just gonna go down here so we can talk. Quickly. There's people down there, we'll go down here. Okay. Okay, so here I am at Costco and I have just been this morning to have a mammogram done. So it made it perfect sense to come to Costco on the way back on my way back home and I just ran into a friend at the door that I haven't seen for ages. Her and I used to spend a lot of time together because our daughters did ballet together and I got so anxious. I don't know why. She's so gorgeous and I just got so anxious but I told her. I said, you know what? I haven't got anxious for so long and I don't know if it's because we were reflecting about the past and we were catching up and I don't know but I got so anxious and I got hot and sweaty and I haven't done that with anxiety for ages so I just said to her and so this is how I handle it for those that get anxiety I just said look I'm really sorry I don't know what it is but I just get hot and sweaty when I'm around you I get anxious but I want to keep talking to you because it's so good to catch up and that's how I handled it she went oh that's okay that's okay so just owned it just owned it rather than me standing there going is my is, is my face dripping uh, what's she gonna think so rather than dealing with that I just dealt with whatever I just dealt with the honesty of it and it felt good it felt really good okay but now we are in Costco doing the thing this lazy spa how good would that be to have at home at the new house okay I don't think we're getting bananas not today they don't look that good though I normally can dive down and find some good ones but I'm not sure let me see see these guys look no they don't look very good See, the children seem to be going through a bit of an anti-banana stage as you'll see if I decide to make banana muffins today when I get home actually I can't make them when I get home but later on today I could let me have a look gluten-free bread yes we'll get this blueberries $21.99 for all these blueberries I would love these I love 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 them but I don't think I'm gonna get them let's see what what price is the strawberries okay so we'll be getting this I like going down the bottom to choose which ones we want let's have a look at this one so relaxed today going through here I'm driving the wrong way and it's so annoying for other people so I will go the correct way I just mushrooms are just so good for you and I always forget to use them but I think I might get some today these ones look quite nice don't they Sh shiitake mushrooms or I could just get the plain cut up ones maybe I just get those asparagus for ten dollars I think that's really good value I think yes it is it's really good value all the seafood looks amazing prawns look incredible cooked tiger prawns $64.99 for two kilos I think this shopping today is quite different I think you are going to think it's more like my shopping in the old days if you did follow my channel in the old days with Costco it's probably gonna look a bit more like that only probably if I get the frozen broccoli <laughs> I wonder if there's frozen broccoli today. To get your dog some Christmas biscuits, $12.79 and you are saving $3.20. Okay, 
goodness me, that's fantastic. Okay, so I'm jumping back to a voiceover because I do start talking to you about things that I really want to put on a different video. So, so I'm just gonna take this opportunity to talk to you about what my plans are for grocery shopping moving forward. First of all, I'm gonna do a huge meal prep and that's mostly because I'm doing a business launch this week. So I really need to have food on hand to make sure that the family's eating really healthy and that things are organized and that because the children and myself and my husband are in and out all day, we all have different schedules and they're not fixed schedules, they change. It's really important that we have that food on hand and meal prep is definitely the easiest way to do that. So that's why I'm doing a mega, 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 mega massive meal prep tomorrow. Remember before we moved house, I did the huge 11 day one. It worked so well. So I'm going for that sort of concept again. But this time I'm actually going to double up on the vegetables. And that's just because we just, as a family, just felt like we need to come into summer, just ramp it up even more on the healthy foods. So we'll be doing that. So I'll be doing that. The other thing with my grocery shopping moving forward is we live six minutes away from two supermarkets. And these are supermarkets that I'm not that familiar with, but it is Coles and a Woolworths. And it's not the one that I usually go to because I still live only six minutes in the car from there. Probably not even six minutes, probably more like three. So, but these ones are six minutes walking distance. So what I plan to do is, is put my meal prep into the freezer or most of it, and then what I'll do is I'm going to go for a walk each day. Different times of the day, and I'm going to go to these two supermarkets. It's gonna be part of my fitness routine, and I'm going to see if there's any meat markdowns, and particularly ones that we can throw on the barbecue, because my husband and the family, we're loving the barbecue. The barbecue and the indoor-outdoor flow here is fabulous. And my husband is such a great cook on the barbecue, and he loves it. So my plan is to go walking each day, go to the supermarket, see if there's anything that stands out, make sure that I don't go over budget or go out of budget or that, which would be so tempting when you're going to the supermarket every day. Pick up some meat markdowns and if I find a really fabulous deal, I'll bring it home. And I think that's gonna be fun because as far as walking goes, I sort of need a destination. I sort of need a project that would really help me walk. So that's my plan. Who knows if it will work. As soon as I meal prep, I'm gonna put it into place and see how it goes. It's not ideal because Ellie like, still needs to be walked, so we have to share her walk with all of us. But for me, I think it's going to work really well. So here's hoping. Look nice. $23.99. Flavoured virgin olive oil. I skipped a few aisles. These. But I haven't actually used them. I need to use them up. They're in my pantry. I didn't really like them in the end. That's the sort of cushion I want. Look at them. It's sort of flecked with brown. It's probably not brown. It does, it looks like it's flecked with a bit of brown. It would be so nice on my couch. There's only one. One wouldn't do. $22.99, 50 times 50 centimetre cushion. Oh, the floor mats are save $7, $14.99. These are the best floor mats. I must see if we need another one. I feel like we do in this house, but I need to check. Anyway, all the Atkins bars are $6.50 off, $25.99. That's similar to the old price. So I was mostly here to be honest to get the chickens and so I feel like I'm done but I did actually get quite a lot so I'll see you at home and I'll finish off, maybe I'll finish off telling you what I was telling you. Too busy at the checkouts, just a little bit. Okay here's what we got, it's, it's not really, it's not laid out very gorgeous is it but you'll get the idea. Three chickens but one other chicken and I just got home and I just ate some and everyone here was hungry so we all just, that was pretty, pretty much all there was to it. So four chickens, corn cobs some big slab, a big slab of salmon, 4.4 kilos of beef mince, some tortilla chips, uh, cos lettuce hearts, rye bread, two lots of that, eggs, 60 eggs, mushrooms and bacon, a three pack of bacon, the big huge bag of carrots, asparagus, peppers, broccoli, gluten-free bread and gluten-free pizza bases. So this is all going to come together nicely with my meal plan and meal prep, which I'll share with you in just a moment. Okay, just back from Coles and Aldi, and this is what I got to contribute to my grocery haul this week so I can do meal prep. So these were on Markdown. Actually, there was a lot of Markdown at Coles, and people say have asked me, when do you find the best Markdowns? 
It depends on the supermarket, but this particular supermarket seems to be mid-morning. There were so many meat markdowns, but I just, I just didn't want to get them because I already have a plan for this week. Um, so yes, I just got what I wanted, which was these um, squid chips and um, salt and pepper squid. So that, that would make a nice meal for us all. $3.20, saving $4.40 per, $4.80 for this one, $4.40 per um, container. So that was really good value, so I grabbed those. Uh, but there was a lot, there was a lot there. And there was a lot of seafood, there was barramundi, there was um, sea seafood melodies, and lots of chicken. Lot, there was um, like a cleavers, lasagna, grass-fed lasagna, so there was a lot. So, and all really great value. I particularly went to Coles to pick up, while well, they're on special, the gluten-free um, pasta. So I got some lasagna sheets for meal prep and also I got another lot of spaghetti because last night we had chicken with pesto and spaghetti gluten-free and using the Costco chicken. So I thought I'd go and replenish that for meal prep. We may actually run out of rice, well almost, like we've probably got a cup left, so I got some rice. Because I am meal prepping, I got the big tins of uh, diced tomatoes even though you've got to open them which is a bit annoying but I got three of those I got some wraps because I've got lots of eggs I've got 60 eggs as you know so I'm going to do breakfast wraps tasty cheese oops I'm trying not to scrunch tasty cheese just to make meal prep so much easier I'll be using this with the, either the beef or the chicken most of the sauces I'll make in my meal prep I'll make myself but just to make a few quick meals to use up the chicken and the beef I will use that as well sour cream because I've got a potato dish I want to make, chocolate, I've got two of those. Oh, we've moved on to Aldi now, so that was all I got from Coles, I do believe. Aldi, I got the cheese, the apples, the pink lady apples, the sour cream, I got the pasta sauce from Aldi, salami for sandwiches, coffee, some more rice crackers because it really is our number one snack. Um, I often in the afternoon will have a few of these with avocado. And the children, as you know, love salsa, so they just dip away in the salsa with them. I got two lots of pineapple for breakfast, and I got some uh, strawberries. Because we, oh, because we, you saw the fridge in my, in my last grocery haul, I think my last Audi grocery haul, the other day, where I got a sort of head start on this grocery haul, you could see how empty the fridge was. So all of this is really not making a huge impact, but it will once I meal prep. And I still really do need to start doing a pantry stock up slowly. So I'll start doing that again. I don't like to hold too much on stock, but a lot more than I've got at the moment. Okay, I got the gluten-free pizzas uh, at Costco. So these are just two from Aldi for that aren't gluten-free. So it just makes it more affordable because these are cheap and the other ones are expensive. I got two lots of water, one lot of lemonade. I saw this lime juice. I thought that's perfect with my avocado to stop it from going brown without having to the expense of a lime. This was a uh, dollar for the whole thing. Butter and water. And there's the other chocolate. So I just quickly jump in and tell you what I'm planning on cooking with the meal prep. I will be doing scalloped potatoes with beef, beef lasagna, beef in packs for beef nachos, chicken pizza, beef pasta, chicken pasta. Salmon meals, that's something different. Salmon dinner, beef patties, our smash patties that you know we love for the barbecue. Chicken curry times two, and chicken salads. So, you're not gonna wanna miss that. Mega, mega, mega meal prep. Okay, so thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I'd love to have you here. And don't forget meal prep video tomorrow and well, coming soon, might not be tomorrow, but coming soon. If you like this video, you may like my last grocery haul, which I will put up here. And otherwise, I'll see you on the next video. Bye.